about 20 minutes. I've been calculated since we're going to other places. We're going to be uh, going to Kyoto and Tokyo. And uh, there's a lot of local trains that we get to. Uh, we, get to we get to take the Shinkansen, which is the bullet train. It's going to be very fast and very, uh, very interesting. train direct to Shinjuku where Airbnb was and that took about an hour and a half from the airport um, so yeah last night we were just really tired just grabbed a quick bite to eat and then went to bed I love the feel of being surrounded by tons of people <laughs> I feel so I love safe that feel. I feel so safe and it's, it's so quiet nobody's talking except me <laughs> we just took the uh, the metro lines it's so crazy it's so busy and literally like, you just you were being surrounded by everyone uh, now we arrive in Jinza which is the world's shopping center so for ladies if you haven't been there maybe check it out there's all the high-end brands and uh, we are gonna walk from Jinza to the Zukichi fish market this is uh, one of the uh, largest fish market in the world now it's a beautiful sunny day it's 20 degrees in Tokyo Right now it's 9 in the morning, um, so we're super excited what this city has to offer. Everything will be fine. We're just um, walking 
walking along. We just left the Tuziki fish market. So we're just walking down the um, streets of Tokyo. We're still in the Jinza area. We're gonna catch the metro and go. Um, go to the Imperial the, Palace. Yeah. Rated number one tourist attraction in Tokyo. Basically, we're gonna see the what where the old emperors live. Yeah, so we're gonna check that out and check out a few attractions around that area. And Getting some cultural experience, and that's <laughs> why I want to do. That's how I want to live. Items tonight. Yeah, I just uh, I just got my adrenaline shot, and uh, I'm heading to Shinjuku, famous, infamous, pissing lane. Yeah, it's called pissing lane. It's called pissing lane because and they have the one of the most interesting dishes you can, like, you can never find anywhere else in the world. So and there's six alleys, and within those six alleys, there's over 200 restaurants. There's about 200 restaurants, and back to back. each restaurant has its own unique dish for example like frog frog sushi very looking forward to that because as you know i'm a big foodie and yeah. i love exotic food i'm probably just gonna get like noodles yeah i'm not adventurous at it's all okay. <laughs> all right stay all right. tuned Very interesting taste. Very solid. Good morning, guys. It's Sam and Dan. It's day three in Tokyo. And uh, we're more used to the Japanese customs. I feel more like Japanese now <laughs> after doing all those things. Can we go to the garden first? Yeah, yeah, it's close to our place. There's a very close garden. Yeah. It's a big garden. We just want to take some nice pictures and uh, later on going to Tokyo, central Tokyo, and then after that, we're gonna have lunch at uh, Tsukichi Market. 
Yesterday was a was a holiday, so we didn't actually get to see the tuna auctions and stuff like that. All the interesting stuff. But we're definitely gonna go back today. Again, it's a nice sunny day, and uh, yeah, the weather's treating nice uh, the weather's here. treating us really nice, and we are degrees every day. very happy. So we're very happy with this trip so far. Morning. It's very refreshing. Very refreshing. It's clear and it, it's kind of a perfect, perfect method for uh, for meditating. Pretty cool. Oh, our dish is arriving. 